So over here you can see that I have some color swatches that you can use. So you can choose this and then you can start drawing with it and that particular color will be drawn out. But if you want to add in more swatches or delete a swatches as well, you can go around and then click the minus button to delete out these swatches right here as you can see. But if you want to add in swatches, then you can use the hue saturation and value right here just like this and change around the shade according to how you want and press the plus button and you can see that that particular swatch will be added and you can draw around with that particular color. What you can also do is you can go around over here on the uh, right hand side, click on the menu right here and click on new color, color swatch right here to add in the same function. So it just acts as the plus button right here. So another thing that you can do is you can go around and right now it is on the swatch mode as you can see. But if I were to uncheck this now you get to the swatches mode like this. So you can go around you can see that the new color is named new. But you can go around click on this and rename it to tube to color 1 let's say for example and this is what you have. You can also go around and type in tube to tube color 2 right here and there is another color as you can see right here. So you can go around, choose out the color over here by using the default option or you can go around over here on to the top right hand side, go to RGB sliders as well and use red, green and blue values to choose around the value as per what you like as well. And you see the shade of all of the colors right here as you move these sliders right here. So uh, a bit of green, a bit of red right here and you can see the colors that you can use and press the plus button to create a new swatch. You can also go back over here to swatch mode and then you can see you get back all the swatches once more and you can click on it to start drawing just like this. And that is how you can add and delete color swatches inside of Toon Boom Storyboard Pro. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.